Now, unfortunately, the Fever's two playoff losses preventing the team from bringing in a playoff game back here to the Circle City. Still plenty to be proud of. I mean, we've gotten yeah. to watch some great basketball this year. Still out crowds, record-breaking sales, and attracting fans really from all over the place. I gave everybody a reminder of the season that was and a look at what could be ahead. From Denver. We're really excited. The, the Clark effect is, is real. To New York. It's pretty exciting because I like Caitlin Clark and she's pretty exciting to watch. And Maine. We're on fire. We're, we're excited. Even as far away as across the pond, England and Ireland. Oh, we come over to see the game. We heard about Caitlin. We have a daughter. We love what she's doing for the game. I believe Caitlin is a massive hero in America. Ann Bastinelli, a marketing professor at the Indiana Kelly School of Business, says this fandom isn't just basketball. This has become more of an, a cultural, more of a cultural moment, an inflection point. These fans also injected more life into downtown Indy. The summer can be a slower period in between the Pacers and Colts season. This year, Fever fans filled that void. The entertainment district felt a little bit more energetic. We told you about the Caitlin Clark effect as the Fever drafted the superstar out of Iowa in April. The numbers this season backed that up. Nearly 650,000 tickets were sold this year to watch the Indiana Fever play, breaking the overall WNBA attendance record by more than 200,000. Even more TVs were turned on for each of the Fever's nationally televised games. I think Indiana has had a fever dream now for about four months and, and just loving it. The numbers that came out of Gamebridge Fieldhouse this season sound made up. A nearly 1,200% increase in jersey sales, 1.3 million followers gained in just three months. Even a 740% increase in beers sold at Fever Games. Bastinelli thinks this momentum will only build as fans look forward to next season. I would not see a letdown. In fact, I think there will probably be much more excitement about tickets, 